You're Rick, right? I'm Negan. I don't want to kill you people. Just want to make that clear from the get-go. We are not monsters. I want you to work for me. <laughs> we survive. We provide security to others. We bring civilization back to this world. We are the saviors. But we can't do that without rules. Rules are what make it all work. Sucks, don't it? The moment you realize you don't know shit. How do you help You want to know why people are going to start dying in there? Because I'm not there to stop it. You see, I stop people from dying. I am the answer. What we do, saving people, it is hard. You don't scare easy, but it damn well works. People are a resource. I just slid my dick down your throat, and you thanked me for it. Are you confused about who we are? Are you confused about who is in charge? You can breathe. You can blink. You can cry. You could have just let me save all of you. Hell, you're all gonna be doing that. I mean, that's why I killed your friends in the first place. I know it's not easy. You got there's always work. There is always a cost. Here, if you try to skirt it, if you try to cut that corner, people are the foundation of what we are building here. Back to it. Speak what you're spoken to. You answer to me. You provide for me. Provide for you. You belong to me! You will do your job! These people, they are always gonna know that there's a loophole, a way to skate. They are always gonna be looking for that chance to push back. So now, I gotta kill all of them! Just like I'm gonna kill you! Winning? isn't about beating you. Winning is about killing every last one of you. It's just that no one ever thinks that they're the evil one. Was it supposed to be this way? Is this who you wanted to be? I never wanted this. Rick made this happen. I keep scratching at you. I keep trying to figure out what's underneath it all, because I think if I dig deep enough, I'll find a person, someone I can help. But I never do. All I find is more... You can't save me. Or my people. Or even yours. You can't save anyone because you don't care about anyone. My wife's name was Lucille. My only real wife. Till death did us part. Before this. I lied to her. I screwed around on her. She got me through. I didn't give her shit and she got me through. Please. Please don't kill me. Why? You have to just do it. You tell me why! <clears throat> tell me! Why should I? So I can be with my wife! So I can be with the family! <laughs> she was sick. <laughs> and when she went, I couldn't put her down. That is how I was weak. That is what I will confess. I should be dead. I have to be dead. The bat. The bat got me through this. So I named it after her. 
That's it. Nothing more to do with her than that. But it is the last little piece of her that I got left. I can't be like this. Please, please don't make me stay like this. Just settle it. Settle me. Kill me. Please. I got a good look outside my 10 by 10, and there is nothing here for me. Not anymore. I came to kill me again. Dad! You're already worse than dead. Keep it. It'll help you find your way. There's a reason that he's in a cage, Judith. He is a monster. No, he's not. He's a human being. But he has done monstrous things. Did you tell her what you did to Glenn? To Abraham? Oh, I got you. I got you. Uh, uh. Are you okay? Okay. We would have loved to have had a kid. We would have loved to have had a kid like Carl. You were lucky.